Hello and welcome to my third tutorial on wall sets brought to you by RCT Coast. Right, so to start with, wall sets can be found in scenery, walls, roofs and buildings, and each set is listed here. Now you may see these funny looking things here like ATH catwalk set and these supports here and things like that. Now they're custom scenery which I will do a separate tutorial on another time um, but we'll focus on the ones that you automatically have when you load the game. Uh, these custom scenery sets are downloaded. Um, wall sets can be made to make buildings and other interesting things like stations but for now I'm going to do a simple tutorial on how to build a house. So to do this I'm going to use brick walls and now you'll see all these funny looking pieces here you think hmm what are these? How am I supposed to make anything with these? Well, basically, the base ones, the ones that say base, are the ones that go on the ground. The others go above them. So if I wanted to make a two-story house, I'd go to base, brick base, wall with door. That's going to be the front. Now you'll see there'll be a tile. Now the tile can be placed on two sides um, on paths. It can't be placed on the inside, only on the outside. Um, and you, when it's okay to be placed, it will be blue. When it's not okay to be placed, it will be red. So, first what I'm going to do is place a door. A brick base wall with door. There we go. Now, that's going to be the front of our house. So, we'll have a look from the front. Um, now, I'm going to put some windows either side. So, brick base wall with window. Put those either side there. And then if we go to... See if I can find it. Corner, brick base and corners in. And I'm going to put some more corners in there just to kind of finish off the side of the house. Now, on the back, I'm going to put some more windows. Now, that's one story done. Now, how you add a second story is very simple. We go to, I'm going to use a brick wall with windows. Notice how it's not a base, it's just a normal brick wall. So I hover over the piece that I want it to be above until it's red. And then when you hold the shift key, the piece will now be above the current piece. You can make it higher by moving your mouse up and down. But for now, I'm gonna keep it there and click. And now we have a piece. Now, what I'm going to do is put some more brick piece, um, brick wall with windows. Finish this up. Might put some on the sides as well. And now, finish off the corners with find it brick wall corner. So over till it's red. Hold shift. Click. Over till it's red. Hold shift. And it's blue. It's okay. Click. Now to add the roof, it's just gone dark. No, no, it's not. Okay, it's light again. Um, so what we're going to want to do here is go to. I'm going to add a roof. So full height block roof. Hover over where I want it to be. Move the mouse up or shift. Click. And I'm going to do this all the way along. Now, if you have a the platinum version of Relicity Tycoon 3 or Deluxe, it is in the UK. When you place a piece at a certain height and you hold control, the piece will automatically be at that height for you. That's a neat tip um, to make things a lot quicker and easier for you. So, Z to rotate the piece, or you can use the rotate the current item button, um, and then raise it and click. Raise it, click, or control. Makes it a lot easier if you're placing everything at the same height. Now we've still got a gap here, so to fill that in, I'm going to use small block roof, rotate it using Z or the rotate button, hold shift, raise, control, place it at the same height. Now I can fill in the wall. So what I've done here now, um, whilst I've just dimmed the screen, 
um, is I've built fences and a garden with some flowers and trees. Makes it look a lot more like a house now. Um, the fences can be found in scenery, fences, and I've used redwood, and they can be placed in the same way as walls, clicked and raised using shift, etc. Um, only these do cling to terrain, so say you had like a, a mound of terrain, which I can show you over here, and I try to build fences on it, the fences will actually conform to the terrain. To follow the shape of it, whereas if I use the wall set, try and use brick walls again, you can see that it's not conforming. Um, so I'll just remove these for now. I'm removing them by right clicking on them, or you can also do remove them by using delete objects, select item to delete, and clicking on it. Right, so now you might wonder. Um, you know, I've got this big house, say so I didn't want it. I don't want to have to delete it all individually. Now, there's a really quick way to do this. You go to delete objects, select area to delete from, click and hold the left mouse button and drag until you selected the entire area you want to delete, and press delete section, and everything in that selection is now gone. So, that was my tutorial on wall sets and a bit of de deleting as well. Um, how to delete things and um, thank you um, rate and subscribe, comment, that's greatly appreciated thanks